Here we have another mapping and we're asked to determine whether the relation is also a function. So again, as I stated in previous video, if the mapping confuses you, all you have to do is simply write out your order pairs. So remember, uh, the first column represents your X values and the second column represents your Y values. So you just follow the arrows. For example, your first ordered pair is negative 3 comma 2. Then you have negative 3 comma negative 8. Then you have 6 comma 5. So if you look at your, all of your ordered pairs, again, all we're looking to see is that none of our x values repeat themselves. And here we see that uh, our x values do repeat themselves. And since they do repeat themselves, we have to conclude here, because of that negative 3 appearing twice, uh, that this is not a function.